Well, what is going on? Why did you tell Polly to get her hat and coat? Because she's going, along with the Lloyds and that pair you let in. I've never seen anything like it in my life. My God! I said, what are you on about? Why are they leaving? I'll tell you exactly why they're leaving. First of all, I go up there and I find that that girl in his arms, in Lloyd's arms, five minutes later, Polly's in there. What girl? That, that girl! She's his daughter. What? <laughs> she's Mr. Lloyd's stepdaughter. They're all one family. <laughs> She was at school with Jean. She's known them all for years. For years, huh? For years. What have I done? What have you done? I told them to leave. You've told them to leave? Well, how was I supposed to know? Why didn't you tell me, you halfwit? Why didn't they tell me? You can't blame me for this. Go and tell them they can stay. Why don't you go and tell them? I didn't tell them to go. Oh, no, no, I suppose it's all my fault, isn't it? Go and tell them. No. Now. No, I won't. You will. No, no, I won't. Oh, yes, you will. Oh, yes, I will. Right, yes, that's right. Leave it to me. Let me get you out of it. That's all I'm good for, isn't it? Basil Faulty Limited. Other people's messes cleared up by appointment of my wife, Sybil. I mean, what am I going to say? Tell them you made a mistake. Oh, brilliant. Brilliant. Is that what made Britain great and truthfully a middle of the Yes, I uh, think she probably did. 